Then we joined in to some uh, reviews. Hey, John Z. All right, buddy. Just thought I'd jump on and do a quick selection of uh, some angry sauces. We have the uh, sweet and smoky tomato, a hot and smoky barbecue jerk, and then an extra hot. Carolina Reaper. So we'll start with a sweet and smoky tomato because there's not much in there, it's just spices I think. But I'll give you the list of ingredients anyway. We have tomatoes, onions, demerara sugar, white vinegar, tomato puree, spices, smoked paprika, garlic, oregano, citric acid, salt and olive oil. You short, J18, how's it going? As you can see. Nice funky looking labels, and there's a fair old size bottle, it's a 250ml size bottle, so there's a fair old bit of sauce in it as well. And I forgot to get a spoon, that was silly wasn't it? I'll have to drink it instead. <laughs> Better give him a shake. I'll try and get some out of my finger. You see? Nice thick sauce. Mmm. Like it says, it's a lovely sweet, really sweet. Get that hint of smoke, smokiness coming through with the paprika. We're getting a lovely taste of the herbs that are coming through, the oregano coming through. Mm, overall, it's a very um, nice tomato type style sauce. As you'd expect, very family friendly, no heat at all. Nope, there we go, look. But again. Not getting any like uh, not too much vinegar in there, so you're not getting the vinegar taste. You're getting a really nice tomato flavour coming through with a lovely bit of uh, herbs coming through. So that's a nice splashing on sauce on burgers, chips, uh, anything like that. Pizzas. See, kids would love it. It's very minimal heat, and it's a nice big bottle. Yeah, very nice. That's the sweet and smoky tomato. Next up, then we got the hot and smoky barbecue jerk. As you can see, nice looking colour on him. Ingredients for this one then is tomatoes, peppers, demerara sugar, white vinegar, onions, limes, scotch bonnets, garlic, smoked paprika, mixed herbs, salt, olive oil, olive oil, soy sauce, and balsamic vinegar. Again, funky label, nice big bottle again. Just about drink it because I forgot my spoon. Again, going to have really nice mixed herbs coming through straight away. You are getting that sort of jerk flavour in the background. Nice amount of garlic making its way through now. But a very smooth sauce. Not overly sweet. Not really getting much of the lime coming through. Just a hint of the lime in the background maybe. And just that small amount of heat. Coming through now. Very mild again though. 
a very nice sauce. I'd make a nice uh, chuck it on things, marinade, chicken, chicken wings, or something like that. Mm. Okay, a very enjoyable sauce and you just splash on everything really. Again, chips, burgers. Be superb. Quite like that. Oh, it does really get, you do get that jerk, lovely jerk flavours coming through. With the spices, paprika, garlic. And it is a bit more lime coming through now. That's a very nice, uh, refreshing taste, actually. Again, another lovely sauce. Well made, nice consistency. And I say, a nice big bottle. Get your barbecue out, whack it on here. Happy days. Very nice. On to the last one, then. We have a extra hot Carolina Reaper sauce. I don't think it's going to be that hot because the Reaper is only 5%, but we'll give it a go. Peppers, Demerara sugar, white vinegar, onions, garlic, Carolina Reaper 5%, scotch bonnets, ginger, salt, citric acid, and olive oil. Again, nice looking colour. Funky looking label, nice big bottle. I haven't done this for a while. How would you forget a spoon to do a review? What a plonker. Right, immediately there is, you are getting the heat in this one. Definitely the chinense kind of taste off the peppers. Really onion, onion and garlic. That's coming through really nicely. Again, not too sweet, but a nice. I would say like a bit of a Tabasco -y style sauce. Starting to get a bit of ginger pu pushing its way through now. Okay, that's a nice sauce. Quite impressed, them three, got the honest. Definitely worth a try these arrows. Lovely pepper, definitely pepper forward. Straight away then the onions and garlic start to come through. Like I say, it says extra hot reaper sauce, but I will put it down on the medium to medium low kind of scale. Probably a two to a three. generally a very nice sauce again i'd love I'd, I'd have it on the table and be splashing that on anything chips pizza great on pizza pasta some rice dishes with chicken be nice nice salad we'll have a zing maybe bit of a, add a bit of zing and a bit of heat but again nice consistency nice color very nice sauces so it's another one, cracking sauce. I've actually tried another one, which is a sweet uh, mango and scotch bonnet. Now that was beautiful. Imagine, you know, like the dips, McDonald's fries dips, but better. That was lovely as well with minimal heat, but very nice and fruity. Right, guys, I'm going to grab some chicken wings now and munch some of this. There's bound to be lots of new products about. I haven't been reviewing or anything, so i got a few to do. But uh, let's see all your reviews, guys. Get the new products going. Get them out. Right. See you later. Bye.